Hey guys, it's Charlie. Uh, this is just a quick video. I wanted to bring to you the unemployment, the official uh, government unemployment report that came out this morning. Uh, employment report, I should say, for the month of April. Uh, it was 10 times larger uh, job increase than the ADP report that came out two days ago. Briefly, uh, for those you don't know, ADP is a private, the largest provider of payroll uh, services in the country. And their report is generally looked at as being... Uh, more in the trenches. ADP knows um, what's going on in these businesses because they write the payroll for them. The government is is birth death modeled and this factor is added, this factor is subtracted and you end up with a report that says we created 300,000 jobs in the month of April yet the unemployment went, rate went from 9.7 to 9.9%. Uh, I'll attach both reports with this video um, and I'll do a longer video tonight on the continued uh, demise of the stock market. It looks like it's still going to have another uh, big day dropping. Uh, basically, you know, the the Greece debt crisis, the European debt crisis that's coming to America uh, is taking hold. We're seeing another big sell-off today. But one economist in this Bloomberg article cracked me up when I read what he had to write about uh, the jobs uh, information that came out today. This is from uh, economist James O. Sullivan. The improving eco uh, economic data is one reason the Greek crisis is unlikely to derail the U.S. recovery, according to Mr. O. Sullivan. I love it. I mean, these people have their heads uh, so high in the clouds. I, I, I can't believe that, that these people are paid great deals of money to write this stuff, you know. We have a, a small job grow, uh, increase in the month of uh, April, and it's going to head off the sovereign debt crisis that's exploding around the world. Wow. Mainstream media, way to go. I'll do another video later tonight, but for now, that's all I got.